put it very clearly, you have no constitutional right to endanger the public and spread a disease, even if you disagree. You have no right not to be vaccinated. You have no right not to be vaccinated. You have no right not to wear a mask. You have no right to open up your business. Wait, if, can I stop you? Hey, Did, yeah. No right. Yeah. Not to be vaccinated, meaning if they decide you have to be vaccinated, we have to be vaccinated? Absolutely. And if you refuse to be vaccinated, the state has the power to literally take you to a doctor's office and plunge a needle into your arm. Plunge a needle into your arm. Where is that in the Constitution? To prevent, if the vaccination is designed to prevent the spreading disease. If the vaccination is only to prevent a disease that you will get. For example, if there's a disease that will kill you, you have the right to refuse that, but you have no right to refuse to be vaccinated. You have no right to refuse to be vaccinated against a uh, contagious disease. Public health, the police power of the Constitution. Gives the state the power to compel that, and there are cases in the United States Supreme Court. We always make a deal. We always make a deal. But it's gonna be a different kind of deal because it's gotta be a deal that respects the values that in the new world order regarding uh, local policing. And you pick the people to run those agencies and the deputies that are pledging allegiance to the new world order and good governance. 